Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill track daily challenge using Python programming language. Before going to logic, if you didn't subscribe to our channel, then subscribe right now and make our work more meaningful. Let us solve today's daisy using Python programming language. The program have to accept two strings. S1 and S2 and it must print the score calculated from S1 and S2. How the score is calculated? If the A character occurs in both S1 and S2 in same position then we have to increment the score by 2. Score is incremented by 2. If the A character in S1 occurs in S2 but in different position then score is incremented by 1 finally we have to print the scores as our output there is a note if a character position is given then it cannot be used again now the program have to accept two strings s1 and s2 and print the score calculated from s1 and s2 how the score is calculated If the character A, if a character occurs both in S1 and S2 in same position, then score is incremented by 2. If a character in S1 occurs in S2 but in different position, then score is incremented by 1. Finally, we have to print the scores as our output and we are having a note condition here. If a character position is given, then it cannot be used again. Now let us consider for our test case for a better understanding. So this is our test case. So in this test case we can see that the last letter A occurs in both the words. So it occurs in same index. So score will be incremented by 2. So let us delete it and the score will be incremented by 2 and we have to iterate over each word each letter in the word so we can find that a is present in the second word so b b is not present h h is also not present u u is also not present and v v is present in the third position so let us make it as a star and increment the score by 1 so it becomes 3 now next a a is also present in word 2 so let us make it as star and increment the score by 1 so score becomes 4 and n n is also present in word 2 so let us increment the score to 5 and make the n as star and finally the score will be printed as our output so 5 will be our required output now let us consider for our last test case. In this test case we are having two words. So score is equal to initially score is equal to 0. So we can see that the first letter of the two words are A and A. They are same letter and in same position. So the next letter B also and then C. 
so let us increment three letters are in same position so score will be incremented as six so let us eliminate the letters so after eliminating the letters we can see the words here so b b is not present in the word two and a a is present in the second word so let us increment the score by one and let us make it as star c c is also present in the second word so let us make it as star and increment it by one d is also present so let us increment by one so finally nine will be printed as our output now let us implement our logic in python 3 first let us get the input s1 from the user list of input dot split as we are making changes uh, in s1 so we are getting the input as list format so similarly we have to get the input for s2 and then let us uh, initialize a score to zero so score is equal to zero and then now let us iterate over the for loop and pass our conditions for index in range min of the index ranges from min of uh, len of s1 and len of s2 min of len of s1 comma len of s2 so inside this for loop we will pass our condition that is which is minimum it will become the range and if s1 of index if s1 of index equal to equal to s2 of index means if the letters and the position are same means we have to increment the score by 2 so score plus equal to 2 and after incrementing we have to change both the letters to asterisk for our convenience so s1 of index equal to asterisk and s2 of index equal to asterisk so this condition works only for the same letters in same position so next let us iterate over the for loop for index 1 that is int 1 in range len of s1 and for int 2 that is index 2 in range len of s2 and let us pass our condition here it ranges from len of s1 len of s2 if s1 of index if s1 of index 1 that is int 1 is not equal to asterisk and s1 of int 1 equal to equal to s2 of int 2 if this condition satisfies we have to increment the score by 1 so score plus equal to 1 so after incrementing the score we have to change the s2 of index to star so s2 of int2 is equal to star s2 of int2 equal to star and finally we have to add a break statement here so that the loop goes to the next character of the word finally we have to print the score as the output so this will be our required code for solving today's dc